Jeremy Davis and Clay Johnson founded the fabulous Equinox Orchestra uh, somewhere along the Louisiana-Mississippi Delta. Their love of jazz, swing, and big band sounds, well, it's thrilled audiences all over America for the past 25 years. During the COVID shutdowns, these guys recorded not one, but three brand new albums. I want you to welcome to the show the fabulous Equinox Orchestra founders, Jeremy Davis and Clay Johnson. Yeah, thank you. Excited to have you guys so here. So happy to be here. You know, that shutdown of a year turned out to be pretty good. Three albums in a year. It was a positive note. That was one of the one of the bright one spots. One of the positives. Yes. What kind of music are people going to enjoy when they get to the fabulous Equinox Orchestra? We always like to say that we use the big band as the luxurious musical vehicle of choice. We mm. play everything from Elvis to Ray Charles to Johnny Cash and original music and uh, of course, the Sinatra stuff from the 50s and 80s pop songs. We do a little bit of everything. Right, we, we got our start in, uh, a, as a big band playing these kind of big Dean Martin, Sinatra type of songs. Yeah. But we're from North Louisiana, so uh, we, we kind of went back to what we know and what we <laughs> love. You, you didn't grow up that far from me, brother. Yeah, I, I know exactly where you come from. But, you know, I love this style of music that we don't hear hardly ever anymore. And it's so powerful. You know what I find interesting? Young people love big band when they hear it. It's like this new thing for them. Oh, yeah, they dig it. It's but so it's extravagant. It's crazy. You know, having that many instruments, that many musical voices, those beautiful harmonies, it's unique and special. You're right. You guys grew up together. You were kids playing together. So, I mean, this is something you've done most of your life. For a long time. Uh, the, the story we tell that our mothers will deny to their grave <laughs> is that uh, when we were in seventh grade at, in West Monroe Junior High, uh, we had every class together, and that's the truth. Huh. And uh, our moms discovered that on the night of open house. They went to all the classes and realized they were in every class together. And they said, hey, our boys have to be friends. And so they forced this friendship upon us. It was uh, a bit of an arranged friendship, if you will. <laughs> and we've, we've, been, we've been stuck together ever since. So we did junior high, high school. We started our first bands together. We were college roommates. Right. We met our wives at the same time. We got married two weeks apart. Wow. Uh, and then we ended up moving on the very day of Hurricane Katrina, relocating to lovely Savannah, Georgia. So that's that's kind of our story. I want you guys to come back uh, because I know when we hear your music, we're going to want to hear a whole lot more of it. People are going to love the fabulous Equinox Orchestra. I guarantee it. I like it. <laughs> and I do want our audience to get connected to you guys in the fabulous Equinox Orchestra. And in order to make sure that happens, we're going to turn it over to Keith Bilbrey, who has a really good knack for telling the people at home how to get the music. For their music and concert schedules, go to equinoxcrew.com. Be sure to look at the spelling of that one on your screen. 